Hello and welcome back to Boas Bikers channel. For those who are here for the first time, welcome and please click subscribe and hit the bell so you keep up to date. It won't cost you anything but it will help me. So today we're going to keep on changing my Mina, that's my BMW R1200 GS and it's up to the crash bars today. We're going to give them a black color. So let's get them off first. So after changing my tank and the beak of the bike to black with Plasti Dip, I'm going to try to do that to my crash bars today. So I'm going to take off the crash bars and then afterwards I'm going to Plasti Dip them. Today I will only take them off, I guess, because I'm having my hair cut later on. So the blackening part will be tomorrow or some other day. Okay, first problem. Way in there, there is a bolt and it's a Torx 60 or Torx 55, I don't know, but I can't get in there. My Torx screwdrivers, they are just way too big. They won't fit in. So what did I do? I went to my car dealership and I asked them to take it out. So they did. The rest I can do myself. So I will have to take out this, there, then up there. And I don't know, but I think that's it. And of course, the same at the other side. So I took all the bolts out. These are the two big bolts I couldn't get out myself. They're a Torx 55. Then the next to them were these bolts. They're a Torx 50. And then in the middle there were these two bolts. That's a Torx 27. And at the top there were these nuts and bolts. And that's with a 10. I took them out. So now let's try and take the crash bars off. I'm going to try to take them off as a whole, but I don't think it will work. But I really don't want to take them apart. Let's try. I don't think it will ever fit over the tire. It's not going to fit over the tire. I'll have to take them apart. I really don't want to do that. But well, hey, that's life. So I got them out. Here they are. Time to prepare them to painting. So first what we have to do is clean them, degrease them and then plastic dip. Let's get started, but not now, because I have the hairdresser's appointment. See you later. Now, let's get on with the crash bars. I've put my Mina out of the way a bit, and I've suspended the crash bars on a makeshift thing, so I can clean them, degrease them, and paint them. So now let's start. I have some lukewarm water with a product in it to clean them and then the degreaser to degrease. So I think that's clean enough. So let's start degreasing now. Remember, your hands can leave grease, so don't touch it afterward, afterwards. Wear gloves or do as I do, use a paper towel to hold it.
clean and degreased, ready to spray. Mina is waiting. Hey, we got the plastic dip ready. So now let's shake it and spray it. Let's go. I changed clothes because of the overspray. Don't want to ruin my good clothes. So that's coat one. Now let's wait half an hour for coat two. We'll do about three to four coats. Hey, do you prefer your bike with or without crash bars? Leave it in a comment down below. Let's get started on the second layer. Let's start coat three now. We're almost there. So do you like your crash bars painted or not painted? Let me know. Leave a comment down below. So I think I will go for a fourth and final layer and then four hours of drying minimum but I think I will wait until tomorrow to put it back on the bike. Let's do this! That should do it. Four coats. Now leave it for four hours at least, but I will leave it until tomorrow. See you tomorrow! Have you painted your crash bars yourself? Let me know in a comment down below. That looks okay, doesn't it? Hey, welcome back. I've let it dry for a night, so today is the day to put it back on the bike. It's a bit windy today, so I hope it doesn't uh, interfere with the sound. So let's get started. Here we have everything we need to put it back on. All the bolts with the according um, bits. And then let's put them on the bike. I have also put down an old mat, an old rug, uh, to protect the crash bars when I lay them down in the floor. The lower bar is done now, so let's go to the upper bar. I've put some uh, protecting foil around the bar, so let's try and put it on now.
that's one side done that's it now let's see let's take off the protective foil there we have it crash bars in black looks good don't you think now what do you prefer the black or the silver colored crash bars leave your opinion down below in the comments and if you haven't done it yet please subscribe hit that bell button and like this video it doesn't cost you anything but it will help me thank you and see you next time bye